This is my story. I got married to my husband in 2018. A traditional marriage at that. Till date, I don't have a child. In 2019, a family friend took my husband and I to a fertility clinic and tests were carried out. It was discovered that one of my tubes was blocked and my husband had a low sperm count. He was given drugs to take. The doctor told me I could still conceive with one tube. My husband refused to take the drugs as he felt nothing was wrong with him. So I started looking for solutions to unblock my tube. I took in herbal remedies and even pharmaceutical medicine. In 2020, I went back to the fertility clinic and this time, the doctor told me both tubes were blocked because of untreated infections and the only solution was in vitro fertilization, IVF. I told my husband and he refused. He then started cheating on me with several ladies and the worst part is he didn't even try to hide it. I was still trying to find solutions to unblock my fallopian tube. Early this year, my husband started dating this particular girl. The girl started dictating things to my husband. Basically, the girl was the one controlling everything going on in my marriage. I cried myself to sleep most days. He would come home rubbing it in my face that the girl he was seeing is pregnant for him and the problem was never him and it's just me. I was so ashamed every time he came to me to tell me the girl was pregnant for him. After the fourth time he told me the girl was pregnant, I asked, in fact, begged him to let the girl keep it. If I could not have a child of my own, I could at least raise this one as mine. My husband came back to tell me, the lady says the only way she's keeping the baby is if my husband marries her too. In the beginning, I said our marriage was a traditional one, which means he is eligible to marry another woman if he desires. So my question is, should I allow my husband marry the other woman so I can have a child to raise or leave this marriage?